Ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, on behalf of the Chinese Embassy in the UK, I'd like to extend our warmest congratulations on the launch of the All Under One Moon Virtual Program 2021. This program is timely and meaningful. It is held in the year celebrating the 100th anniversary of the founding of the Communist Party of China. Under the leadership of the CPC, the Chinese people have achieved miraculous success through long-term and arduous efforts. China has realized the first centenary goal, building China into a moderately prosperous society, and now embarked on the journey of achieving the second centenary goal that is to build a strong, modern socialist country in all respects. In the process of this great course, culture and tourism have played and will continue to play an essential role. This virtual program will present vivid cases of poverty reduction through preserving intangible cultural heritage and developing tourism in rural areas. They will tell the story of how the Chinese people are always striving for the best. The program highlights the value of harmonious coexistence between man and nature. Throughout its time-honored and splendid history of over 5,000 years, the Chinese civilization has valued harmony between man and nature, and advocated respect for the nature. Today, China is working to improve people's well-being through high-quality developments and building a strong, prosperous, and beautiful country throughout a coordinated approach. We believe that mankind belongs to one community with a shared future and we intend to work with all countries for an open, inclusive, clean, and beautiful world that enjoys lasting peace, universal security, and common prosperity. Later this year, China and the UK will host COP15 and COP26, respectively. They are two major events on global environmental governance. Our two countries need to work closely together to make the conferences as productive as possible. The All Under One Moon virtual program will contain projects on green development and biological conservation. They will highlight important values such as lucid water and lush mountains, are mountains of gold and silver, and man and nature share the same future. The program will boost China-UK cultural exchanges and help build a closer bond between our two peoples. China and the UK are representatives of the Oriental and Western civilizations. Every civilization has its unique beauty and creativity. Sharing this through exchange and mutual learning increases diversity and enriches all civilizations. Take tea for example, the culture of drinking tea started in China, but here in the UK it has been developed into a most exquisite and elegant form, the afternoon tea. It is my hope that more friends here will be able to appreciate the unique charm of the Chinese culture. One upcoming opportunity will be the Guangzhou Garden at the Chelsea Flower Show, which will be built around the traditional Chinese value of all under heaven are of one family. I hope the virtual program being launched today will display the promising prospects of cultural exchanges between China and the UK. I'm sure it will help build closer ties between our peoples and contribute to the development of China-UK relations. In a few days, 
we will celebrate a traditional Chinese festival, the Mid Autumn Festival. This festival carries the Chinese people's love for the family and country, as well as our dream for a beautiful world shared and built by all mankind. In conclusion, I wish this virtual program a great success. And may you and your family have a very happy Mid Autumn Festival. Thank you.